What's up guys? In this tutorial I will show you how to model this in Revit without using a dynamo, and how easy it is. Let's start. First let's take a look at the parameters. We have an attractor offset. This is a distance how far is the attractor point from specific point or location. Let's change the value to 1200 millimeters. Apply. Next. We have the attractor divisor. This is the number that divides the attractor offset or distance. Let's try to change the value to 20. Apply. Perfect. This means that the bigger the value the smaller the output. Next. We have the U-grid. This is the quantity along U-grid of a divided surface. Let's try to change the value to 10. Next. We have the V-grid. This is the quantity along V-grid of a divided surface. Let's try to change the value to 10. Apply. Perfect. Now let's try to change the attractor offset value to 1500 millimeters. Apply. Not much difference. Let's try to change the U-grid and V-grid value to 5. Apply. Perfect. Let's try again to change the attractor offset value to 2000 millimeters. Apply. Perfect. Let's try again to change the U-grid and V-grid value to 10. Apply. Perfect. Let's try again once more to change the attractor offset value to 1000 millimeters. Apply. Perfect. In part 2 we will make this model with attractor be sure to subscribe. That's it for now. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.